Okay guys, on today's episode, we're going to talk about, see I got a little man in the back sleep, so I'm trying to be quiet, but presentable at the same time, okay? So on today's episode of my electrical vlog, we're going to talk about, you know, on my first video, I was saying the importance of getting into the trades, you know, trade school. But I didn't specify the difference between trade school and an electrical apprenticeship. It's different, okay? You guys got to understand that. It's, it's a difference between trade school and an electrical apprenticeship, okay? So on this episode, I want to specify that, all right? Trade school, usually those are scams, okay? That's your North America trades. That's your... Um, what else is it? Uh, all all state careers, all those, and I hope they don't try to sue me for slandering that name. But it's true, they're scams. They don't teach you anything. You pay all that money, and once you get out of there, you don't know nothing, and not, and their credentials aren't even good enough for when you try to get a job, when you try to get employed. So, in my first video, I said the importance of getting into a trade, but I didn't specify. The difference between trade school and electrical apprenticeship. So that's what, like I said, that's what we're talking about today. The electrical apprenticeship is where you want to go. That's what you want to do. That's either getting in a union or non-union. It doesn't matter. You can. I I started off non-union. Okay, I started off non-union. I did four years apprenticeship with ABC Metro Chapter of Baltimore. Okay, and then. There was nothing wrong with that. If you guys want to go non-union, or if you guys are non-union, that's totally fine. But the goal is to get into an electrical apprenticeship, not a trade school, okay, guys? An apprenticeship, a four-year apprenticeship. You're not going to learn anything in a trade school. Those are scams, okay? I want to stress that, all right? So you can, you can now, like I said, I did non-union, I did my four years, and I decided to go into the union. So now... I'm in the union apprenticeship, so I have to do their apprenticeship. The In Baltimore, here in Baltimore, the union apprenticeship is five years, okay? That's that's union, but non-union is four years. So I completed my four years non-union, and now I'm, union, I'm in the union, and so I have to do their apprenticeship. So that's what I'm currently doing now. And uh, my advice is to just get in. Stay focused, you know, like I said, your first two years are always the hardest because you don't know much, you know, you have to be spoon-fed information, you're probably pushing a broom all day because you don't know anything, you know, my first two years, I didn't even know if this is what I wanted to do, but something just told me to stick with it, you know, something just told me to stick with it, so I stuck with it, and I love it now, I'm, I love it, it's, it's changed my life, I love it, so I, that's what I suggest, you guys get into an apprenticeship, uh, stay focused. It's going to be hard. You know, your first couple years, since you don't know anything, like I said, you'll be pushing a broom. People will be spoon feeding you information and everything, but just keep your head down, stay humble and focus. You won't get that. Okay. And it goes by fast. All right, guys, it goes by fast. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm not going to talk you guys ear off. I just wanted to, I just wanted to elaborate on that. Like I said, my, the point of my channel is to spread awareness for the trades. It's important. Nobody talks about this. The trades are important. Okay, hey, you're always gonna need. You're always gonna need a plumber. You're always gonna need a steam fitter. You're always gonna need a welder. You're always gonna need an electrician. Those jobs aren't going anywhere. Okay, through this pandemic, matter of fact, through this pandemic, I have not. I have not been off of work one time. Okay, one time. The only time. I, is when I transitioned from non-union to union. That's the only time I was off, and that was only a matter of a week. Okay, but if I stayed non-union, I wouldn't have been. I wouldn't have been late. I wouldn't have been laid off or anything. That was my choice, basically, to to make that transition. So, like I said, it's an essential essential job. You will always, always have a job in the trade. It's college is a scam. I'll keep saying that college is a scam. Trade school. It's where, I mean, I trade school and apprenticeship. See, I almost messed up again saying trade school. It's an apprenticeship. The apprenticeship is what you guys need to do. All right. Love you guys. 
Like, share, subscribe. See you next time.